something truly goddamn strange is going on! This is the IMDb studio at Acura Festival Village, and look, it's the director and the cast of Velvet Buzzsaw! Give it up for him, ladies and gentlemen! I've seen this trailer, and holy f <laughs> What is the movie about? The movie is a satirical thriller set in the world of L.A. contemporary art, and it's got a Robert Altman sort of ensemble cast that we follow through it. Good call, man. I didn't realize that. Oh, but a big I Altman the trailer, fan. It is Huge a little Altman fan. It's a little bit player, a little bit mash, a little bit Nashville. Nice DNA. And I love the way he took like a, a big cast and followed a story through these interlocking stories. And I, you know, I got Jake, I got Renee, Billy, Zowie, Natalia, David Diggs. I managed to get a lot of people involved who are Tony great Collette. talents. Tony, Tony Collette, Collette, who's not here right now, Huge but cast. yeah. The trailer reaction was massive. Online, you guys owned Twitter for like a day when it went up. We did, we, yeah, we did. It's it's a bad crazy trailer. It really is. There is some sort of power. You, I've been seeing everywhere, sir. Was it like jumping into this flick? Uh, yeah, just a great opportunity again. Like when you hear like Dan Gilroy once put you in a movie, you're like, yeah, I'll, I'll show up. And he's so funny. I'm sorry, I just have to say. <laughs> you're oh, funny. They're all so damn funny. Yeah. No, I'm not, but they are really funny. This is the first time you've been up here. Or you've been up here before. No, I've been uh, to Sundance before, but not at this capacity. I've always had to like like hitchhike to get to, to the right. road. Now Here's I, somebody actually this drove you up I to got, the festival. Yeah, I got a ride. Really, <laughs> I feel like the slight like, competition winner in this cast. Like when you see the lineup of everyone, and then me. It's I like, saw the. Oh, no, no, no. nice no for them way. to invite, you know, no that way. poor girl. A uh, guy upstairs, he died. And you just took them? He had no family or friends. Do you delve into the art world yourself or no? Yeah, I did. It's not like the fashion world or the acting world. It's so intense and, and brutal in a way that other industries aren't. One of the best things about doing the film is we shot nearly exclusively in downtown LA and there's some How intense awesome is that? galleries and studios. So I just saturated myself um, and had a great time. Saw some, saw some weird Stranger things have happened to you. What's, uh, what's, <laughs> thank you. Hey, my pun game is strong. How is this movie for you? I mean, Dan's name is just like, uh, Yes, automatically. But, you know, reading the script, scripts tend to speak for themselves. And it was, you know, such a great read. And the characters really jumped off the page. And you're, yeah, you just sign me up, please. You were writing for years before you started directing your stuff. Was the whole time, did you know one day I'm going to aggregate to directing? No, I never wanted to direct. I've never been leading people. I've never been in charge of people looking at you going like, what are we doing today? You find who you are, how you inspire or lead or tell people what to do. He's awesome as a director. I just want to say, I'm just going to put it out there. Dan, you're phenomenal. Amazing. Enjoyable working with and anyone you collaborate with is. Psh. Critique is so limiting and emotionally draining. 